George wakes up. Now, this is the morning where he, this is the morning after he just found out that his car is going to be in the shop for two weeks. George woke up the next morning feeling tired, anxious, and stressed as usual. Every day he wondered what else was going to go wrong. But at least today he knew he wouldn't have car problems. Because his car is in the shop. <laughs> How many times do we personally do the same thing? Be it you wake up that day, you're going through the day, something shifts maybe in the middle of the afternoon or in the evening, but you just go through the day wondering what else could go wrong. Also in here, he talks about, now this is definitely a phrase that I think we all should apply in our lives. And if you're following along in the book, it's on page 16. And George says, as my old football coach used to say, we don't talk this game, we play it. So I hope to see action soon because if you don't get it together, then we both know what has to happen. So this thing called life, are you in it to play it? Or are you in it to just talk it? Are you going to talk the talk and not walk the walk? There is a difference. And you can see it in people. You can see the people who just talk, 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 talk and talk, and yet nothing ever transpires. Nothing goes on and nothing changes. There's be it the same path, same situation. Do we want to be in the same path? Do we want to stay in the same situation? Do we just want to sit back and talk a talk? Or are we actually going to get in there and play this thing called life? Life is an adventure. Go out there and make the best of it. Enjoy it. Experience it. And quite honestly, no matter what age you are, go out there and enjoy it. Find something you enjoy doing. Find something that you want to do. Louisa, you don't understand. What are the excuses you give yourself? Too fat, too skinny. Too tired, too wired. Too tall, too short. Slow reader, fast reader. There are all kinds of excuses we could all use. But each and every day you use those excuses is another day gone. Tomorrow's gone. You can't get it back. You have today. You have this moment. What choice are you going to make? What kind of energy do you want to draw to you? Back to the last last session. Do you want that person who's always pointing out all the negative things and the things that you did wrong? Or do you want the person who's going to lift you up, inspire you and encourage you and help you along the way? Who do you choose to surround yourself 